is nothing to be proud of. Oh. But uh, it's very beautiful. Hey, Jackie, he's got the same belly button as you. Oh. Right there. Oh. there you go. Very beautiful. And what's that? What is that? Wait, hey, wait a second. What's this thing over here? Is that a Frisbee? It looks like he's carrying two symbols. Oh, it's a discus. Well, it looked like Robin's diaphragm. Oh. If only I could see your diaphragm. Too small. How dare you? You know what? Woman is a celebrity. I used to like you guys. Yeah. Hey, anyway, <laughs> let me uh, also tell you that our spokesmodel this week sent us a videotape. Oh, really? Yeah. Now, if women want to send us videotapes, we like that. This is Pamela Raines. What was in her videotape? Oh, you got the video. Thank you, Dan. Well, now I'll know, won't I? How'd you like Dan at the sketch of the, in the uh, beginning of the show? Oh, he was very believable. Yes, very good. <laughs> what he should be doing is ushering at a movie theater. Well, he will be soon. <laughs> anyway, here's the videotape we got. It caught our attention, so uh, I'll let you see it, Robin. Okay. There she is. Now, I take it this is just a girl. She's not an actress or a model. Uh, I don't know. I think she's just, uh, I think she's a mechanic, actually. Really? Yeah, well, you see her with that car. <laughs> Look at that. There she goes. And she, she, like, stood around a car a lot and, like, moved her hair a lot. Uh-huh. And showed us her body and stuff. Then she got she in the car. She sat in the car with sunglasses. Yeah. And then she, like... Ooh. Well, how'd she do that? She huh? just changed outfits. What a little actress. Wow. She couldn't figure out how to start the car. That was the problem. <laughs> <laughs> so she just got out of it. Now, is she advertising that the car wants to be on the show? <laughs> hey, don't you kind of... Oh, I'm standing on one leg, and now... Ooh, yeah. I think her belly is... Ooh, wait, wait a, a second. Wait a minute, what's in the woods thing? Well, she had to go to the bathroom during the show. <laughs> Actually, I was talking to her before the show. She got lost during the taping of the car thing. She's looking for the car now. <laughs> yeah, right. Well, this is kind of like a Tarzan and Jane thing, you know what I mean? Is that a real wooded area? Oh, ooh. Uh -oh. Well, she had to go to the bathroom in this one. <laughs> <time. laughs> <laughs> Something about standing next to a wall. Oh, what is this? This is on a deck in a chair, I think. Picture yourself on a deck in a chair. <laughs> with, And that's sort of like, you know, the, the sexy chair And there was pose. no sound, just... No sound. So anyway, I'd like to introduce you now to Pamela Rain. <laughs> there she is. Woo! Yeah, you know, you look a lot better in person than you do in... Uh, here, take a seat. Well, Why actually, you... I didn't recognize you without the car. Wow. <laughs> look how beautiful you look. Did you lose weight for this show? Oh, no, I've gained weight. You really have gained really? weight? Really? Because you look good, because I, I thought you had, I thought you had flab in the picture, and look at you, how tight you are. No flab. And you're not a model, a professional, or I'm anything? I'm not a professional model, but I do a little bit on the side. You do? Hobby. Where did yeah. we see you? Did we see you in Vogue, or Penthouse, or uh, any of the magazines? No, no. Where does hobby modeling model. get you? Hobby modeling. <laughs> well, what do you mean, hobby modeling? Hobby modeling. It's a hobby, right. you don't ask right. for money, you just go out and model and stuff? Right. Really? More or less. Yeah. Would you ever just models fun. wherever she is. Yeah. Would you ever consider bless, breast implants? No, I wouldn't. You would not do that? Not in a million what, years. What, do you think there's something wrong with her? No, no, no. I like them very much, but I know a lot of the young models are going to that. Well, that's probably why I'll never make it big, because I won't do it. You got a lot of cheese in that belly button? Oh. No. Oh. No cheese. It. It's clean. Yeah. Go for it. You ask. You're supposed to ask. Hey, she smells pretty good, too. Hey, she, she prepared for this show. All right. <laughs> now, are we going to do a commercial with Pamela, since she is a spokesmodel? Are we going to do the aerobics commercial now? We're not doing no. that now. A little bit later on, you're going to come out, we're going to do a commercial. You're going to be an aerobics girl, right. and I will be the aerobics instructor. Mm -hmm. And then we'll start doing some stuff, and then we'll do some commercials, all right? Sure. All right. Mm -hmm. Very good. All right, we're going to be right back. Jackie and Frank Stallone are here. We're going to hang out with them. Robin's got some new stuff, and also Stutter and John's going to be here with... Uh, Amelda Marcos. We've got a couple of big breaking stories for you. Hey, one of the weird things that happened this past week, too, is Brandon Tartikoff went in the hospital, and we sent him tons of flowers and stuff. I hope you got him, Brandon. Brandon's the head programming guy at NBC. Hey, Brandon, we sent you flowers and stuff. Don't you want to uh, put us on that network? We didn't even get a thank you note, but that's okay. Yeah, we understand. We'll take a show. Yeah, <laughs> we'll just take a spot on your network. <laughs> we are very hot, you know. Hey, anyway, of it. we got a couple of things going on. By the way, a little later in the show, Stutter and John actually met Imelda Marcos. 
I thought that was an interesting combination when you said stuttering John and Imelda Marcos. You know, she is free. Yeah, well, he met a whole bunch of people. Leona Helmsley, Imelda Marcos, and Imelda, I think, got hot for John. You're really? right. Yeah, yeah I think, uh, hmm. yeah, he, you know, she re he sort of reminds her of Ferdinand, <laughs> the late dictator. Well, anyway, I'm looking forward to that. I don't that. know how she managed to see that. But. Yeah, right. But anyway, what else is going on? Well, you know how it's the beginning of the year, and it's the time when most heads of states or cities have their State of the Union or State of the City speech. And our very own mayor, Mayor Dinkins, gave his State of the City address this week. And I decided to check on the State of the Mayor. You know, the last time he gave a speech, we went along and counted right. how many times he wiped his brow or mopped himself during the speech. And he's still sweating, even though he's been on the job for a year. I'm telling you something. It's like the sweat of the city address. This guy's sweating. What is he so nervous about? <laughs> you mean he, he, he doesn't stop sweating? You'd think now he'd calm down in office, but he yeah, he's, sweats. I thought it, he was nervous because it was a new job right. at the beginning. Right. But it continues. Let, let's see if it's getting any better. All right. We have a little review. We have what was going on last year in 1990, what he looked like. Okay. This is 1990. Yes, this is the old sweating. He's mopping his brow. <laughs> and in 1990, we gauged him, and in nine minutes, he mopped himself ten times. Is that a medical condition? That means one time every 54 seconds. Right. Now, this is this year. He starts mopping before he even gets to the podium. And he mopped with his hand. All right, that's the first one. And I guess they must hide those things in the podium for him. I saw a cool move. He actually, when the, when the crowd starts applauding and they go to the audience, then he starts mopping. You so. missed a two-handed thing there. Let me see that one. Wait, I want to rewind that one. I missed it. Everybody, let's uh, take a look at that. That was a very cool move. You, now the two, this is from last year, right? Yeah. All right, here comes the two-handed one. Let's see. That's behind the, behind the ear yeah. the man Yeah, oh, sweat. he does everything. He's got quite some Look at moves. his eye. Wait a second. Did you see his eye? He gets all full of sweat. All right, see, now he's mopping already. Yeah. <laughs> That's his nose. That's his forehead. Now watch this in a minute. Here he goes. Forehead and... Now one oh, hand and the other second. hand. She had two mops in his head. <laughs> Holy cow. This is a double mopper. This is a harp. So in 1991, in 23, uh, 23 times in 32 minutes for a 65% reduction. So he is improving. You're saying that And this is slow motion, just so you can see technique if you have this problem. You mean, you're telling me he sweats less now? Yes. Look at the guy behind him. <laughs> He's got to be like P.U., you know? <laughs> I was like, gee whiz. This is a problem. So anyway, that's the state of the mayor. He is getting better. He runs our city. <laughs> you can stop that, too. All right. Also, Howard, you know, I hate to uh, turn to a serious note. This is sort of a funny show. Robin, it's a Saturday night. We want laughs, okay? <laughs> what do you mean, serious? But, you know, something that we have never taken seriously is the AIDS situation. Yeah, we tell people not to wear rubbers on this show. <laughs> We're very irresponsible. We admit it. Unfortunately, many, many people are dying. I know. Isn't so, that terrible? But I think we've lost too many people. The fashion industry is being wiped out. The theater industry wiped out. Yeah. We've got to stop this loss of life. Amazingly, our staff lives. <laughs> So I thought that maybe we could encourage people to practice safe sex by showing you what they have tried to show on Los Angeles television stations. Bunch of freaks. To encourage people to glove up, as they say. Really? Yes. This so is an AIDS thing, huh? This is an AIDS PSA, if you will. Here we go. Whoa! Get out of here. Oh, yeah. yeah something? Oh, you mean this? Whoa! Whoa! You know what I mean. Wait a second. Did she just say, are you forgetting something? And then his head went his down? His head and... disappeared. And I said, yes! No. Yeah. <laughs> he did forget. No. Hey, if I was her, I'd do that, too. My wife will see this and go, why don't you do that? I said, I'm not did interested. Did you forget something, honey? Yeah, I forgot something, all right. <laughs> about nine years ago. Yeah, right. I forgot that the day, about three days after I met you. I forgot that. I'm not doing that. I know her too well. <laughs> but wait a minute. Let's go on. That couldn't be what they meant. Now, how come she's not sweating? <laughs>